There is a revolution going on right now in the way that people consume journalism. We're at a point where technology is going to enable us to view and consume media in an entirely different way. Whether it's in paper, mobile devices, or iPhones, or the iPad, there are going to be a number of ways that people want to engage with that content. One thing that we've been great at doing is telling stories and communicating ideas and information. Whether you're an editor or an art director or designer, you're basically creating story arc, just like a film director does or a musician. We've been able to do that in print. Our readers have relationships with brands. We have a great website, we have a great print magazine, and this is just adding one more avenue of communicating and connecting with the brand of Wired. And really, that's a huge opportunity for magazines. We really would like to offer more choices to our readers and to our advertisers and move beyond just this, the static notion of ink on, on a piece of paper. What we're doing with Wired Magazine is collaborating on a digital version of their magazine with the same designers and the creative people that publish the print version. Newer technologies like Adobe Air are now powering a new wave of interactive capability to display rich text, imagery, animation, interactivity, all within a, a single platform that can reach a variety of devices. There's still going to be the rich storytelling. There's still going to be narrative arc, but we'll be able to do it in short film. And 360s, the ability to, to turn a product around and look at all sides of it. It's this immersive experience which they can navigate completely by natural hand gestures uh, back and forth between uh, the pages of the magazines and all the entry points. If they want to dive deeper and read a full article, they scroll down within that. So we've created a dual axis navigation system. At the bottom, we have what we call the scrubber. And it's got a little thumb that you can browse through and, and see every page in the issue, edit and advertising. Up at the top, we've got the browser. And by touching that, you get a visual overview of the entire magazine. It zooms back and shows you a magazine deconstructed. We also have rich social features, allowing people to clip articles, share them with friends, store them in their favorites bin. The ability to tweet about an article that you like, to post it to your Facebook page. It's a whole new world here for magazines. This is what we've been waiting for for 15 years. We've been waiting for an opportunity to use all these visual tools at our disposal to tell these stories in a way that, that is efficient, that is multidimensional. But we also think it's an opportunity to reset the economics. You know, for the first time, people may value this experience so much that they'll pay for it. Advertising is as important as the editorial in, in all of our magazines, and especially in Wired. People come to Wired for the authority of the edit and the richness of the experience to learn about new products and services that our advertisers provide. It's a really exciting time for publishing because the relationship the user has with the brand is now not just limited to the relationship with the traditional print version of that content, but also there's new ways now to establish those relationships with customers. We want to build a way for our readers to engage with that content on any screen or device that they want to. These changes are on par with the changes that uh, media experience going from radio to television. Wired is known for you know, breaking all the rules in print and doing really amazing things with their design of their print publication. They're obviously one of the most forward-thinking publications out there. One of the reasons we teamed up with Wired was because we knew if we could solve their needs in this uh, digital publishing world, then we could probably solve a lot of other magazines' needs. Um, it's really been a great collaboration between Wired and Adobe.